There are many ways to drive a pendulum. In this case I will show you an electrostatic pendulum. The pendulum is next to a high voltage terminal. What we see here is a high voltage multiplier that can output around 50,000 volts. The pendulum is hanging from a plastic thread. I will now turn on the multiplier to see the pendulum movement. The pendulum is hanging from the thread and very slowly starts to move. You can see how the amplitude of oscillations is increasing. Here we see a drawing of the pendulum and the high voltage terminal. Initially the pendulum is neutral, that is, it has an equal amount of positive and negative charges. The high voltage terminal has an excess of positive charges. These positive charges will repel the positive charges of the pendulum that will move to the right and attract the negative ones that will move to the left. Since positive and negative charges attract each other, the pendulum will feel a force to the left and will move in that direction. However, the force of gravity will pull it back to the right, and an oscillatory movement will begin. When the oscillation is sufficiently large, the pendulum will touch the high voltage terminal. The positive charges of the terminal will flow to the pendulum that will be now positively charged. This will generate a repulsion force between the pendulum and the terminal that also contributes to the oscillation. This excess of positive charges in the pendulum will eventually dissipate to the surrounding air and the cycle repeats.